Breaking overnight, several people rushed to the hospital after a bad crash along Colonial Drive near Hiawassee. You can see one of those cars involved was left mangled. Justin Campbell was the first reporter at the scene. He joins us now live. Justin, this crash shut down that intersection for several hours. Justin, a very bad crash. Still a lot of debris left over in the intersection. A gentleman just got out of his car, picked up this, actually thought that he had ran over something. But as you may be able to hear, there is a crunching noise as cars go by, uh, running over debris. That goes to show you how big this crash was. Uh, tow truck drivers did clean up the intersection, but there's just so many pieces that are left. Now, look at the video. This crash happened just after 2 o'clock this morning. There are four cars involved. Uh, one car in the middle, the roof entirely gone. We believe the fire department cut it off to get people out of that car. But I did get the chance to speak to a passenger, lucky to be alive. He was in a car, the Jeep right next to that car. Take a listen to what he said the moments after this crash happened. I um, feel like shaking, but I thank God I'm still so far and I'm still alive. Now, the driver of the car that he was in is now in the hospital. We know several other ambulances were called here to the scene. Firefighters, though, haven't given us an exact count on the number of injuries. Now, as for the crash itself, we've reached out to troopers to get more information to find out exactly what happened and who may be at fault. That passenger you heard from said that a car ran a red light, but we want to make sure and get everything confirmed till we figure out, and we will pass that on to you. For now, reporting live this morning here in Orange County, Justin Campbell getting results, News 6.